I said, my name is Richard Lemon. With a name like that, I answer to many different names. So uh, please do come and call me by whatever you wish. I will try my best to be polite. Um, a lifelong Cobblers fan. Uh, me and my, we've got a 15-year-old dad. We, we both have been, so we've had lots of connections with the football club. Great programme they run in terms of getting, obviously, uh, young children into it with free season tickets, etc. Definitely took advantage of that. We've got lots of uh, members to look back on. But my main connection, as I've said, through the football club is with the company that I work for, Pro to Labour. I've worked there for 17 years. Uh, we're a proud uh, partner. We make things like the football ticket for match days. We do the game cards for the people reveal cards. Uh, we did the 125 anniversary um, tickets, which were quite special. And uh, we've done some counter uh, count cards and stuff like that. The managing director of the company that I work for is a, a big supporter and advocate of the, the football club, so it's always nice to, to be involved. With regards to the Community Trust, um, both myself and my girlfriend have benefited from the Cobbler Fit programmes. Um, I personally lost over 10% of my body weight when I did it. And as <laughs> um, I feel like I'm in an alcoholic anonymous group or something. <laughs> 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 but um, yeah, like it's been said before, not quite where I'd like to be, but it actually really opens your eyes to what difference it makes to making sure that you're active if you can't you know, keep really sort of fit as the pressure of the modern world would have, so definitely benefit with benefit from that, and a definite advocate of that. Uh, the challenge itself, it's a great opportunity to give someone back, because, I mean, what a fantastic programme it is, you know, it's free charge, you didn't pay for it, it's a great supporter group, met some great people, so it's a great opportunity to get give someone back, raise some money for an excellent cause, um, and it's um, obviously supports lots of fantastic programmes, as already mentioned, and has some really good sort of values and stuff along the way, which everybody agrees with. I myself have been uh, very fortunate to be um, involved in sport from a very young age. Not football, and my sport is bowls, which likewise might sound might not sound like the most active. But over 25 years ago, I was in an under 15 program, so I've been involved with like training little, little children from, to play bowls from the age of six right through to people in their sort of 80s and 90s. Which is it's a fantastic sport from that point of view. That you get lots of mixtures, lots of disabilities. I've uh, been involved with um, playing with people that are visually impaired. Um, and, you know different disabilities, we've got wheelchair bowls, and that sort of stuff. Um, it's just fantastic. It goes to show what a massive difference sport does have in the community, wherever that comes from, whether that's rehabilitation, you know, right through to companionship or whatever it might be. Sport, particularly football, is massive for the community and it's great to be involved in, you know, be supportive and help to assist with that, raise money for it and help drive all these excellent courses forward. Um, it has been fantastic to meet new people, make some new friends. Um, we've got a really good supportive group that will help each other through the challenge. Uh, very much looking forward to it. Even more looking forward to when it's all over and we can relax on the Saturday night in pub. But um, I'm sure we'll get there and we'll, we'll push each other through to, to get through it. And uh, so I'd like to thank everyone for their support and sponsorship on behalf of sort of everybody. And obviously, I need to thank my company that's sponsored me and, and helped sponsor the event as well.